All right, this problem reads that Roxanne runs three quarters of a mile in 12 minutes. Assuming she runs at a constant rate, what is her speed in miles per hour? Now, the question is asking us to convert this given rate into a unit rate. The word per means one. And whenever one of your two units is one of those units, then we are dealing with a unit rate. Now, to convert any given rate into a unit rate, all you have to do is divide the two values, but you have to be careful in what order you actually divide. So, to help keep organized, what I like to do is determine what is the per unit. In this case, it says per hour. So, that is what you have to divide by. So, we're going to put hours on the bottom and we are going to put miles at the top. All right, so it is given in the problem that Roxanne runs three quarters of a mile. So we put miles at the top. So let us go ahead and write three fourths at the top. Now we cannot stick 12 at the bottom because the bottom is hours and notice they gave us 12 minutes. So what we have to do is express 12 minutes as a fraction of an hour. Now we should know that there are 60 minutes an hour. So we can take 12 out of 60 and reduce that to one fifth. 12 minutes would fit into 60 exactly five times. So we can say that 12 minutes is one fifth of an hour. So we can take three fourths miles and divide it by one fifth of an hour. All right, the next thing that we do is we take this complex fraction here and take our numerator, which is three fourths, and we divide it by our denominator of one fifth. And then what we do is we keep three fourths change our division sign into multiplication, and write the reciprocal of one-fifth, or flip it over, which is five over one. And that is gonna give us 15 at the top and four at the bottom, so we have 15 quarters. All right, the next thing we're gonna do is convert this improper fraction into a mixed number. Now, four can be divided into 15 three times, and three groups of four is 12, which is three away from 15. So three is our numerator and the denominator of four stays the same. So we would say that Roxanne is running three and three fourths miles in one hour. Now there's an easier way we could have went about this. What we could have understood here is that 12 minutes fits into one hour exactly five times because five times 12 is 60. So what we could have done is had taken three fourths and simply had multiplied that by five. And right off the bat, that would have given us 15 over four, which then can be converted into three and three fourths miles. 